Alright adventurers, welcome to All Play. We're here with more of the Pokemon Ruby Nuzlocke. Listen, listen, I'm wearing my red today. I'm wearing my red today, so that means let's have a good day, but we're going to be fighting a gym leader. So, I hope things go well. Uh, I trained up the team. I mentioned I was going to train up the team, and that's exactly what I did. Let's reintroduce Team Snaps and Clap, starting with Tough the Aeron, Rockhead Ability, Adamant, Aaron. Uh, holding the Orin Berry. These are the stats. I need that speed stat to get up a little bit higher. I know that it's Steel and Rock, the two heaviest types available, you know, just in general. <sighs> but I need that speed stat to get up. Otherwise, Aeron's always taking an extra hit, you know? Uh, the moves, Headbutt, Mud Slap, Metal Claw, and Tackle. Training Aeron is fun. I cannot lie. Training Aeron is pretty fun. And then we have Magic the Butterfree. Level 18, uh, Aaron is at level 19, everyone else is at level 18. This is a hasty butterfree named Magic. Compound eyes is the ability. Uh, hole in the orange berry. But Magic is pretty dope. Magic is pretty dope. I forget, I often forget how, how good butterfree is early game. And these are the moves. That's what makes it so much fun. I didn't mean to steal the stat page so, so long. I'm sorry. Uh, confusion, Supersonic, Poison Powder, and Stun Spore. I got rid of Sleep Powder, which ultimately is only helping us in the event um, that we need to catch a Pokemon. That's, that's what Sleep Powder's purpose was. And I realize it's not really a good purpose because we do a lot more battling than we do catching. So let's switch that out. So we got Supersonic. We will not have to worry about Confusion trying to confuse because that's what Supersonic is there for. Next up, we have Sure the Wobbuffet, or why not, has evolved into a Wobbuffet. And I'm just now noticing in Gen 3, they didn't have the gender difference of the lipstick on Wobbuffet. But that's all right. That's okay. Modest Wobbuffet. Uh, Shadow Tag is the ability the foe cannot escape. Hold on to Orenberry. These are the stats. I don't know if you guys heard that gulp or not. <sighs> and the moves. Mirror Coat, Safeguard, Encore, and Counter. If I'm not mistaken, Wobbuffet can't learn anything else uh, through through leveling up. That's that's our Wobbuffet. Then we have Beacon the Pidgeotto. Let's take that over. We have Beacon the Pidgeotto. Uh, Rash Pidgeotto. The ability is Keen Eye. Prevents loss of accuracy. Level 18. Oh, no, Warren Berry. These are the stats. The speed is up there. And then the attacks are up there pretty good, too, you know? Speaking of attacks, we have Tackle, Sand, Attack, Gust, and Quick Attack. Doing good. We're doing good as a team as a whole, you know? Next up, we have Wonder the Bee Drill. Uh, Swarm is the ability Docile Nature. Or Docile. Uh, I don't feel like hearing from you guys today. <laughs> these are the stats. And then these are the moves. Fury Attack, Focus Energy, and Harden. Y'all, it is not fun training training up a Beedrill. I think I've said that every single every single playthrough so far. It's not fun training up a Beedrill. Train up a Beedrill and where she should go. Uh, and then we have Master Spender. Own tempo is the ability in this a jolly nature. These are the stats. Pretty dope. And then the attacks. Tackle, uproar, faint attack, and side beam. Mask is bringing a lot of diversity to the team. That's our team. That's our team. That's Team Snaps and Claps, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. So what I say we were going to do last episode? I said... Oh, that's right. I went back to Rustboro City. <laughs> I forgot I went, went back to Rustboro City to train. It was easier to train here than anywhere else. Let me fix that. We're going we're gonna to head back to the island. Give me a second. Okay. Okay, my mistake. I forgot. I forgot completely what I was doing. I was training. Okay, so I said we were going to here on Duford Island, Duford Town, Duford. What? What is it? What? Which one? What is? What is this place? Let's get this done now. Duford Town. I said here in Duford Island, I was gonna <laughs> take on the gym leader. We should be trained up to go. We should be trained up to go and handle this business. All right. Tough up front. Let's do this. Let's, where, where's... Oh, oh, it's another darkness thing. 
It's another darkness mechanic. Okay, let's talk to this man. Hey, how's it going, Champion Bound Chill? I like how that sounds. Yo, I like how that sounds. Champion Bound Chill, that's dope. How's it going, Champion Bound Chill? Duford's gem leader, Brawly, commands fighting type Pokemon. Going against him when normal type Pokemon is asking for trouble. Fighting type Pokemon will lay a serious smackdown on normal Pokemon, so be careful. What's worse, the gym is as dark as the ocean floor, but it'll get brighter after defeating the trainers in your way. Hey, okay, go for it. I like that. Champion Bound Chill. All right. So normally, do we have we have potions? Yes, I stocked up on all the things. Stockable, right? All right, let's move the potions up. Let's 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 reorganize this list as we will need the items. I'm sorry for the pinging. If that annoys you guys, I I, I sincerely apologize. Okay. We got potions. We got we got things that'll be needed. Let's handle this gem systematically. I think nope, no gem leader here. Is there a there's nothing hidden here, right? I've never ever thought to look at that. There's nothing hidden there. Nothing there. All right. So our first trainer is right here. Don't you dare brush me off. It's not my fault if you cry. Okay. Okay. Here we go. It's a battle girl. Yeah, battle girl Laura. She sent out Mareep. I don't know if you guys have caught every single playthrough so far, but Mareep. The Mareep line is probably my favorite line of uh, Pokemon altogether. My favorite entire evolutionary line. We got this tough. We got this. It's a wave. Oh no, it's a tackle. Static? No static? It's a crit? And it only did one? Bruh. Bruh. You gotta get your game up, Mareep. I know Mareep is better than that. Accuracy dropper. This right here is an accuracy dropper. There we go. That's where the points are. Your, your thunder shock. That tackle did zero. That tackle did zero things. All right. Battle Girl Laura is down. And as you defeat the trainers, how much you can see in the gym is widened. Uh, we're going to go heal real quick. All right. Give me a hot second. All right. All good. Okay. Team is healed up. I, c I can't. I Listen. I After what happened last... Last episode, I do not want... I'm sorry, not last episode. Last gym battle. I do not want to enter battle with anybody having lower than maximum health. Might is right. Come on. All right. You get this business too, fam. Black Belt Hideki with a manky. All right, we got to get out of here. Tough, you cannot stay. I'm so sorry, little buddy, but you got to switch out for Beacon. I can't lose tough. I can't lose tough this early, you know? I shouldn't want to lose him at all. But if I could choose when to lose him, it'd be late game, not early game. He's out. And he's done. Not even power. Or you know. Wow, I read I caught that mistake late. Alright, once again, gonna heal. BRB. All right, all healed up, ready to go. Let's do this. Who's next? Who's getting a butt kick next? There's no need for Brawly to be involved. I'll crush you. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? She don't notice I'm wearing this red today. Battle Girl Tessa has three Pokemon. All right. First up is Paris. Hey. All right. All right. Paris, let's catch you with a Metal Claw. How does metal, how does steel fare against bug and grass? It does okay. <laughs> it does okay. We're actually faster than this Paris. That's interesting. I was just complaining about tough, slow speed, but we're faster than this Paris. And why does it crit? Why do we consistently take, lose one point of damage or take one point of damage when it comes to getting critted with tough? That's all, that's so interesting. Next up is Bellsprout. We're going to switch. We'll switch to Beacon. Tough and Beacon are giving them the runs this time around. Vine Whip. Nothing doing. Okay. 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 Hey. 
One more. Next to Swab Blue. All right. Swab Blue. Swab Blue. Here's a gust. Hold this gust for us, fam. All right. Good work. Good work, team. But how? How could I lose so easily? <laughs> well, I don't know if you heard the man at the door, but he called me champion bound chill. All right. Why a little bit more? Once again, BRB. All right. Next battle. Let's get the next one underway. Oh, oh, are we are we finally here already? Okay. All right, two snaps and claps. Let this is pep talk time. I can see I'm gonna have to give y'all pep talks before every every gym leader battle. Okay. Listen, I want us all to go out there and do our best. Sure. Has the most HP, but Lord have mercy, we have got to get lucky with Sure. So, so if we if we need to switch into Sure, I just want everyone else to be ready as a backup, cause cause it's not gonna be pretty. All right, even you wonder you will be the last backup, but Lord have mercy, let's get this underway. Here we go. I'm saving. I'm a, I'm a compulsive saver. Y'all know that. Y'all know that. All right, here we go. I'm Brawly, Duford's gym leader. I've been churned in the rough waves of these parts, and I've grown tough in the pitch black cave. So you wanted to challenge me? Let's see what you're made of. All right, here it goes. All right, Brawly, he's got two. Up front is Mudkip. At level 17, this thing definitely has a ground type attack. We need to switch. Oh, uh, we're going to Beacon. We're going to Beacon for this one. Come on, Beacon. Show up and show out with Bide. Sand attack. Sand attack all the way through. I'm so glad I switched. I'm so glad I switched. Here's another sand attack. Hold the sand attack for me, family. Come on. Come on. Unleash the energy. But it failed. I don't know if you're not. I don't know if you're familiar, but bide makes you waste two turns, and all the damage you, that you take over those two turns is in fact uh, sent back in double. So sand attacks means we deal no damage. Here's a quick attack, just in case you try and bite it up one more time. There's a growl. Okay. Okay. And gust. Okay, we are faster. Dope. There's a growl. Come on, Beacon. Come on, Beacon. Come on. Mm, water gun. I even think, I don't know why. Oh, Lord. I don't know why I didn't think about a water type attack. I instantly thought, oh, he knows a ground type attack. He's going to deal four times as much damage as he should against, uh, damn it. Against, against tough. I'm so glad I did not keep it in because water type still would have dealt a lot of damage. If you don't hold these gusts for us, fam a lamb. Ooh, that crypto. Water gun, hold it. Damn. Even not as a crit is doing a lot. We need to heal. We need to heal. Worst case scenario, he's going to heal here. Worst case scenario, he'll heal his mudkip. All right, he didn't. Good. So we can go quick attack here. Damn. Hold it, Beacon. Hold it. Oh, boy. Okay. Here's a hyper potion for your soul. And he's super potioned it up. Lovely. Love you are a class act, Brawly. You are a class act. Do we have... Damn, we didn't buy super potions. No. Oh, we used them. Damn. We used them. We did buy Super Potion. We used them against Roxanne. Come on. Come on. Just hold it, Beacon. You hold. All right. Uh, we're at the point where if he crits, we're out. What if we switch to Sure? Is this the point where we switch to Sure? Or do we go Magic? I think if we go magic, I think, ooh, 
Yeah, let's go magic. Let's go magic. I feel like this is a mistake. I feel like this is the hugest mistake I'll ever make on the channel. Come on. Here's a supersonic. Damn. Damn! Okay, good. 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 Come on. Yes. Yes. All right. And then we could also poison it. Come on. This is just the first one. We can't really lose anything here. We're not supposed to lose anything here. Perfect. And then the poison. And then this turn should kill. Good work, Magic. I am so proud of you. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of Beacon. I'm proud of Tough. You guys have all worked hard for this one. Beacon to level 19. Next is Lotad. All right. I think we got this. I think we got this. Come on. Come on. Yes. Good work. All right. And then I'll, I'll poison him. And then we'll switch back to Beacon. We switch to Beacon. Things will be all right here. Things will be okay. Snapped out of confusion. How lovely. Oh, no. Oh, it's a status. Okay. Uh, uh. <laughs> Beacon, you're up. Hit your power. Swift. Hold it, Beacon. Okay, good. All right. And a gust. And a gust. That should do it. Yes. Good work, Team Snaps and Claps. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's ugly. <laughs> That's ugly. We need to stock up on items. We really need to stock up. Wow, whoa. You made a much bigger splash than I expected. You swamped me. Okay, you got me. Take this gym badge. You get some money, too. All right. All right, and we got the knuckle badge from Brawly. That's two badges, ladies and gentlemen. Two badges down. The knuckle badge makes all Pokemon up to level 30, even those you get in trades. Obey without question. And you'll be able to use the HM move Flash outside of battle. If you like, you can use this technical machine too. All right. Technical machine he's going to give us. Is it better or worse than what he normally gives us? I honestly can't think about what he usually gives us. Is this one going to be better or worse than what he gives us normally? TM08. That TM contains a mud slap. It's kind of relevant. His uh, his mudkip should have had mud slap. Dope. It's not bad. It's really. I don't think we really have a use for it. Oh, things are goofing up. Oh, things are goofing up. I don't know. Let me save. Let me save. Last thing I need is things to go haywire. Matter of fact, we're not even gonna touch it. We're not even gonna touch mud slap. It's clearly. It's clearly OP. Because it's about to break up the interface. All right. With that done. Now. Oh, I wonder if that happens when we go to use. Oh, that's not good. Because we actually need Flash. Let's boot it up. Who can learn Flash? Beacon and Wonder. Well, Wonder, I suppose. I suppose if you wanted this time, Beacon. <laughs> you can learn Flash. Per I'm sorry. Not Beacon. Wonder. Ugh. Ugh. I shouldn't have named them both six letter names and put them right beside each other. That makes me that makes me sad. I'm sorry, Beacon, I ain't mean it. Okay. Now with that done, what we can do is head to Granite Cave over yonder. Oh back back behind. You know, we can head to Granite Cave and travel through there and deliver the thing that we need to deliver, the letter. To this man, Steven, whoever that is. And then we can progress with the rest of this playthrough. But first, we're going we're gonna to wrap it up here. I'm going to heal if this man doesn't move out my way again. I'm going to be upset. I'm going to be mad. I'm going to throw a fit in this Pokemon Center. I'm going to throw a fit. They're going to have to escort me out this building. I mean it. I mean it. Thank you. All right. 
That's going to do it for today. If you guys enjoyed this episode of the Pokemon Ruby Nuzlocke and would love to see more, then all you have to do is hit that red button below this video. That's that subscribe button. And turn on notifications. That way you get notified whenever a video posts to the channel or whenever we go live with a stream or something like that. <sighs> Thank you guys for checking this out, and I'll catch you later with more here on Alt Play. You see he's all the way on the other side of the room, right? He learned his lesson from last time. <laughs>